What's up guys, Yuxoth here, and today we're taking a first look at Smite Tactics, which is currently in the alpha, so odds are most people can't get in yet. There are some ways to get in on via Twitter and stuff like that, so you can keep on the lookout for that if you're just looking to get away into the game, but for most people it's kind of hard to do so. I was very lucky, and as such, I will check out the game now. I've actually not touched the game yet. I have not tried anything aside of uh, setting the volume, which was... Uh, Pretty much impossible in game and we're gonna look uh, at all the stuff that we have here and then do a quick game just to to figure out stuff also uh, i will make another video today because i have to make up for the fact that i did not make a video yesterday okay so you get packs in the store you can buy packs for gems or favors so basically like smite you get favor per, per daily login and i guess per games as well so i can actually buy packs we can actually just try that once i don't know how worth that is or whatever, but I'm just gonna buy a pack and uh, and see what we get. Got a core pack. Okay, can I see what's in there? No, I just bought a core pack. Let's uh, start. And now we can open packs. Oh, okay, so we open the pack. Uh, da -da. We're getting, yeah. Ah, okay. Give a friendly pardon. No idea what that means. Teleport a friendly Oh, okay, so it's a, an ability for a friendly unit. Teleport a friendly anywhere on the map. Teleport, okay. Gold Fury, okay, that seems like decent stats. I would assume this is like a, a power level, this is like a health level, like damage health, and this would probably be like summoning coast. Um, and she has pardon already, whatever it may be. And then we have uh, the ropes. Deals one bonus damage to minions. Uh, now we need to figure out what minions are in that context, but I guess it's kind of good. I like that card. It just looks cool. <laughs> I don't know why that is temp art, but hey. And then we have another pardon. Well, pardon me. Okay. And now we're going to look into the uh, deck builder. I guess we're just going to create a new deck. So what I know is that the decks are somewhat related to the pantheons. And um, here we have, okay, so uh, we have Zeus and Ra, who are both ranged, so they can actually attack themselves from range, and which I think is kind of good. So they, what have we got? Zeus got spend two mana to draw a card. Okay, I guess it's like getting a card he would otherwise not get. Spend two mana, restore one health and friend lies to all friendlies in target area. So this is a heal. Makes sense for R and Odin give a friendly one attack damage until the start of your next turn. It seems kind of weaker. I don't know if it's just me. I mean, he has a little more health, but he cannot attack from range like the others can, and you don't really want to melee with your with your leader, I think. And he gets one attack damage on one character, and this guy can heal everyone around him for one. Um, I go with. Uh, Odin regardless, because I heard that the Norse are like the aggro decks, and I like aggro decks. So that, I don't want that. And I think I have to just, uh, I don't know, we'll figure it out. I, I gotta see if I get like stuff like Gold Fury and so on here now. Basically they're the ones that I, um... Elder Har yeah, Gold Fury is in here, okay. So can I get two of these? No, I only have one. No, wait, why? Oh, I have two of them. Oh, okay. So, but these are very expensive, so maybe I don't want two. Maybe I just want one. And uh, I don't know how many cards I can have. We'll just figure that out. I like this one. Uh, whatever it brings you. Elder Harpy seems to be a decent choice. Then, uh, I feel like double a god or minion's health? That sounds ridiculous. Let's see. Let's get one of those. Uh, I feel like in the end, you kind of want a lot of... Um, Characters first, maybe? But you can't have a deck without Sunder. <laughs> or two damage, I don't know that's much. I think I'm gonna go with some, like, primarily minions first. And, um, this could be cool. So Sentry want to steal something. And then maybe a Loki, because he has, like, a lot of damage and, like, a teleport. Ymir, Ymir, and minion, just throw something cheap in there, maybe... We can Freya do banish an enemy. Hmm, why not? I don't know how many of these gods I should really pick, honestly. 
But uh, let's just see. What if what if we just pick a lot of guards and wait? Can I get more than one Odin? No, I was gonna say that doesn't make sense. Or maybe just some random. Why would I take? Oh, oh, this take one point and this takes two points. Okay, just some trash to uh, get through the early rounds, I guess. Uh, that's kind of random. That's a bit of a gamble, I feel. And um, this is probably nice. Just okay. I seem to be able to get a lot of cards. Okay, I got twenty cards. All right. Uh, I know what stun does. Crowd control. I I'll stay away from that until I figure out how how strong that kind of stuff is here. And um, shell. Why not a shell? That seems good. Give a friendly guard a minion charge. I really don't know what charge or pardon does yet, so kind of gonna stay away from it. Uh, we're gonna get another gold fury though with pardon. Maybe we would allow you to figure out what it is. And a basilisk. And this is a deck. And I don't know how to name that. Save. Well, that's a great name. Custom deck. Um, is the way to change the name? Ah, oh, yeah, yeah. Just click it. Just click it. Uh, minion Norse. I don't know, because there's so many minions in there. That seems good enough. And now, let's actually jump into a game with all the stuff. I think we have had, like, went through everything we have. And we basically have the settings here with, like, resolution screen type. But, uh, global quality epic. Okay. Let's play. Play versus AI or people. We're going to try versus AI once and uh, then uh, figure out stuff from there. Is that an all in the queue? Okay, now we can replace a card. Um, I don't know if that means I ditch it completely. Like, I feel like Loki would not be good early, maybe? I'm just gonna ditch Ymir and go with E3. I don't know. I don't know if I can get them back later. If I can get them back later, then. Well, I kinda wanna keep this one. Let's go. Why am I walking? Oh no, he's walking. Oh, oh, wow. Okay, starting off nicely, are we? Um, so I have two mana, which means I will just spawn a hunter, which I cannot. Oh wait, I spawned two hunters? What? Okay, cool. Um, shell doesn't really make sense yet. I know why I have this mana potion because I haven't really. Uh, done anything um, uh, but I go with it I guess I, I, I didn't put that in my deck I guess it's just randomly uh, I cannot use anything else though right now because I just realized I had that mana potion uh, so we just uh, enter and see what he does for now that guy goes straight from my archer he, and he spawned a hoppy okay mm. Loki needs five we can't cannot get that yet but we can get a hoppy ourselves and um, we, we could also get Surtur. Surtur, Surtur, Surtur. No, I don't think that's right. I think what I want to do here is spawn a Harpy. And um, move that guy a little further back. I don't know if this does anything for the, like, in terms of cover, or protection or anything, but uh, should be good enough. And uh, maybe I, maybe I want to send him a little further away for now because that Odin is going very aggressive and the Harpy is probably still sleeping and I'm just gonna shoot this guy because uh, I don't know what happens now I know he still has the same damage it doesn't really matter I guess but I have no mana I can't do anything else we'll just go on here uh, okay he's gonna take a lot more damage than that but he took the Harpy as well oh, and he's got Thor already Jesus Christ oh, this guy has so much mana um, what are we gonna do? Uh, maybe a shell and a basilisk. Basic attack, root enemies until the start of the next turn. I like that. Um, mm -mm -mm. Should I get that? Searcher. Searcher doesn't really have much damage yet. I kind of want to get to Loki, but we don't really have mana here yet, so we're gonna have to wait until we get those out. So I think I'm g actually gonna drop Searcher, uh, basilisk and, and shell. And okay. Oh, it's not. Oh, this is just an area effect. Mm. Well then. Oh, whatever. Shell it anyways. 
this guy can go all over that back. He's gonna die next round anyways, I'm pretty sure. But what we can do is still uh, shoot from over here. I don't think Odin can actually... Oh, I could go from behind and attack him in the back, but... Don't really want to do that, because they're gonna walk up to me if I do. Um, as such, we're just gonna end this turn here. I don't... Wait, what? What's this? Two? Oh, okay. Let's see. Wh what am I doing with my two, though? Is that like a... Hmm? What does that mean? What can I do? Oh, oh no, that's the damage boost. Oh no, I should have done that first. I could have uh, amplified the shot on him. But, we can do it with this guy. So he gets some extra damage. Uh, which I think I just did. Did I? I don't know if I'm doing it, if I do it like that. It, I can't really... can't really tell. I have a feeling I'm not doing what I want to do. I should be able to... To uh, somehow somehow cast this on him, I think. And yes, Odin and Rage give a friendly unit plus one basic attack damage this turn. But how? Hmm. Well, round's over. We tried. All right, he's rooted now. That's good. But I still don't know how I can use my two, which really sucks because I kind of would have needed that there. Um, Rip me. I... Uh... Fuck it, we're throwing out the Loki, I guess. Um... Can't get the Gold Fury yet. Or should I get Stirrups and Searcher? No, we're gonna throw out the Loki. Um... Can I... No, I'm gonna move first, so he can't attack me from both sides. I'm gonna move Loki, uh, put Loki down here. Uh-uh-uh-uh. Gonna, no, gonna try and give this power buff again. No, and now I can't even select. The, no, I can select the two, but I don't know if it costs something to do it. That could be the issue, maybe. But I don't know. We'll just uh, accept it, take this guy down, and uh, I'm gonna be in huge trouble because I don't know. Yeah. Well. Yep, it's gonna be all that range damage. That's gonna hurt. They're going for me. They're not even going for the Loki because he's in stealth. Ugh. <laughs> he's sporting even more! Double a god's or minion's health. Can I... That would be nice, I guess, to use next round or so. Uh, not really gonna do the math here. I am just gonna... How far can I go? Hmm... I kind of want to block off the Odin, but I think he can still attack me diagonally anyways. Well... Okay. These archers are going to be a problem. I think I'm going to risk it for the biscuit. Because I don't think... If I throw these two, it's going to be enough. I kind of need something up here. Um, which I cannot spawn. Feels bad. Uh, 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 uh. I think we're just gonna do it. Wait, what's this? Why does he have two abilities? Oh, he has that backstab. Mmm, that's juicy. Um, maybe I, I want to try that. But at first, I'm gonna put down the gold fury. And I'm probably gonna use this uh, Lucius round. So I still don't know how to use this either. Um, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna teleport my dude. Well, I'm not really sure if I... I, I, I kind of want to take down the archers because they're going to do so much damage, but at the same time, I also want to take down Thor because he's going to do more damage. Yeah. That kind of worked, I guess. I cannot do anything more with him, can I? No. Oh, I can? No. Kind of weird. Uh, I don't want to attack the Odin. If I go there, I'm going to take three damage. I'm going to take one damage, so I think that's a better bet. I should be able to survive that round. And then uh, we figure out more. Okay, you take the gold here. That was friggin' weird decision from the bot. Yeah, this is gonna be a decent amount of a decent amount of crash. Uh, what were you doing when the crash happened? Uh, I was in the middle of the game. The enemy turn. Well, that's one way to end it.
I will, uh, regardless of that, upload this as a first look and then upload uh, more later today. I think it should give you a little bit of a first insight into into the game. <laughs> Sorry about that abrupt ending. Uh, well, it's an alpha, so that's kind of to be expected, right? But yeah, um, we'll try and get some more later on today. It should be, you know, I've given you an overview of all the functions in the game, so it should be fine. Until then, thank you guys for watching. Duke Sloth, out.